So are you streaming it? Yeah, just fired it up, dude. Loading the game in now. And it does pick you up as well, so, you know. Tell me if I sound all echoey and crap so I can get that mess fixed. Figure out on Twitch how to, how to find you. Uh... Hang on, I will. It's what is that? Twitch.tv slash freak freakerson. Or scroll up, you'll see a, a link of that I shared in Discord. Got me with my arms all threw up like that. I'm hoping this actually works. That would be awesome. Did you uh, find the link I shared? just buggered that all up well i'm following you though okay yes and thank you for the follow but i didn't get an alert and the reason i didn't get an alert is because i put all of this crap on main and when i copy all this crap hello cat oh well i know how to fix it There we go. Viper, you want to see exactly how far away I am? Yeah, but I'm hearing you twice. You're hearing... Um, mute the stream. If you mute, mute the... Mute where you're watching the stream, where you've got the stream pulled up. I got it. All right, awesome. Here you go. How do I sound? Do I sound all? Was I sounding good or was I sounding all robot-y again? Oh, you're sounding good. No, what would you say to Destiny? There's still like half that lasagna left. Ooh, lasagna? I can eat it tomorrow. Well, what do you want? I want to play to that lasagna. Destiny. Destiny. Go ask Mama what she wants. She's gonna say we need to finish that lasagna, but. Okay, 
I see you scrolling out. I see your beagle point. No, that's where I'm headed to. Uh -huh. I'm still right here. There's where I came from. Of course, it's going to scroll in. Oh, that's my fuel star. But yeah, that's... Sag A, that's the center. And that's 25,000 light years behind me. And how far have I got to go to Beagle Point? 15,732 light years. So just a hop, skip, and a jump, right? Just, yeah, just a hop, skip, and jump. Give me just a second. Are you watching babies again? That's where I heard the sound of a baby. Okay. What? Whatever blows your skirt up. Well, answer. Uh, which is the name? Yes. Did you answer Charlene? <laughs> Duke. Yes. <laughs> System scan complete. Hey, whoever uh, is watching, and the way. Why in the world? There we go. And away we go to the next one. Now there's 17 bodies here. Alrighty, let's scan them down. Yay, gas giants. Geomologicals. Nada. Yeah, I am scanning everything. I'm I'm at the point all I'm mapping is earth locks. When I find them, I'm not even mapping the uh, water worlds anymore. I've already got elite in exploration. But I want to get to Beagle Point and do it, you know, kind of the old school way before fleet carriers become, you know, a massive, you know, hey, we're going to run around here and 
clear 500 light years at a time. heard that somebody in the beta has or some people in the beta have already made it to Beagle Point with the fleet carriers figure by the time I'm on the way back they'll probably by the time I'm getting back towards a bubble <laughs> fleet carriers will probably be released this is a long way out here y'all And even longer when you take time to scan. And not a... And yeah, I'm scanning just for the fact of... I want people to see, you know, my commander name. When they come out here. I want to be as popular as validating... Pardon me, y'all. For those of y'all that don't know, validating is what pops up when somebody on a different system, you know, like Xbox or whatever, uh, discovers something. It just pops up the name. Discovered by validating. But until you learn that, you find validating just about everywhere. And we're all like, who is validating? And how did he get everywhere? And yes, got the biggest fuel scoop I could put on this line. My theory is this, the less time I spend around the star, the less chance I have to overheat. Very nice. Is that you watching there, Chili? No. No? Fine, I don't want you to watch anyway. No, I don't want to watch you in my RV, put it up in this gold. Yeah, I've still got to set the stream up better. I know that for a fact. Because I've got my scenes all screwed up. I should have had a nice blast of the General Lee horn. When Viper followed me, but unfortunately I set it up in the wrong, I set it up in the start screen instead of the, you know, main one. So now I gotta reset that mess up. Ah, come here. Nothing. And more geologicals, which I will be hitting those on the way back. Oh, there's what I actually need.
already think. It's gonna be a bunch of these then. Well, at least they're easy to find. Nada. Wish we could name the systems that we discover. I'd call this one Bob. No features. No locations, no features. Go to the next one. I am going to get that set up. Okay, I've discovered 25 different things. And pull up here. Time to get my scan on. Hey, Chaser, thank you for the host, bud. Mighty kind of you. But I thought your ass was going to bed. Oh, and we screwed up, Chaser. Or I screwed up. I put my sound effect into the wrong scene. Hey, Waterworld. world. And I will leave you for somebody else to come find me. And map. Ooh, a water giant. So you are in bed, huh? Yeah, I do know how to fix it now, so. As long as I don't forget, you know, I do have a, I am getting old. I'm not like, you know, level, massive levels of senile yet. Close. And nothing. Well, nothing but a bunch of water worlds there. Hey, JD, why is it taking you, you know, six months to get across the galaxy? This right here is the reason why. Do-do-do. 
Yeah, Viper asked me earlier, are you having fun doing that? Like, yeah, I'm having fun doing this. It's peaceful. It's relaxing. By the time I get to Beagle Point, I'll probably be going out of my ever-loving mind, but... I am not going to do the get out there and kill myself to make it back quicker thing. I just can't do it. When I get back, I don't know. Do I start working on my combat? Getting it ranked up to elite? Even though I completely suck at combat. Or do I go out mining and uh, get up the money for a fleet carrier so I can do carrier things? Whatever those carrier things turn out to be. All right, 26. There we go. Where are you at? I see, buddy. Get up there. Nothing. Now, that's a unique looking planet. My question is, should I go land somewhere? Get out and stretch my legs. Well, get out and stretch the doom buggy's legs. We want space legs. Geologicals. What I'm looking for is for it to say over here locations and say anything other than none. Hey, buddy. Mm -hmm. Little food, little drink, drinks in your little restaurant. They're not little. Hey, I appreciate my power aid that you sold me at your store. Open all day. Okay, he closes at sundown, y'all. But speaking of sundown, there, son, it is dark where Uncle Chaser's is at. No, he could if he was over here. It'd be daylight for him. In America, that's right. Does Uncle Chaser need to move to America? If he wants more sunlight, he needs to move to America. <laughs> All right, buddy. Is, he, is, is uh, Blade still up? Uh, I th he's actually hosting me on his stream, which is really cool of him. He, but he's in bed. <laughs> he's probably got me on his phone. He's over there crashed out. All right. That was that system scanned. Boogity, boogity, boogity. Let's go exploring, boys.
Will's cooping complete. I think Viper's off playing with the player piano. No, I'm I, here. Oh, good, you are. Yeah. He's being quiet, dude. I'm sorry. No, I'm, I just, I literally just put him back, put my headset back on. Oh, okay. Oh, pardon me, y'all. Hey, what a world. Hey, Charlotte's back. they did. And <clears throat> I will eventually find something out here. Eventually. Oh, you want to you want to annoy Emily? Flip all the cat's ears back and watch her. She hates that. I would say, what did she break? But what did what did she do that she's trying to make up for? You know. Our long-haired female cat has decided that, you know, for, that today is, she's going to love everybody today. Yeah, and if you don't, if you don't pay her any attention, she sits there, she'll sit next to you, and then she'll take her paw and she'll pat on you. Like, hey, I'm right here. Sitting, yeah, just sit and stare at you. Okay, one more planet. Where is it? Hey, uh, JD, that thing was doing a ge geological scan. Uh, I know. I don't even worry about those. All I'm looking for is them to say, like, a location or something. Of course, there's going to be. Well, you have to finish that scan for them to say that there's something there. No, just say it's geologicals. I mean, I'm looking for stuff to say like, you know, alien or, you know, human. Hey, Phil. Thank you for the follow, Phil. I really got to get that thing fixed. Okay, another drooling cat. There it is. Alright, Bob, we'll let it finish the we'll let it finish the scan because I need a cigarette anyway. Well, I appreciate it, Phil. I really do. I mean eight geologicals. Let's go to the next system. Drive charging. Let's see here. Only 121 jumps from my destination.
Yeah, really appreciate the follows and the views. It helps. A lot. At least I guess it does. That's what everybody tells me I need. You need followers and viewers. Okay. I'm just happy to be able to play a game and BS with my friends. You know, Viper, you could always fire up Elite and come catch up with me. Yeah, right. <laughs> you say you don't want to be... When it's all said and done, what, 60,000 light years from Earth? You know what? I'll fire up the game just to find out how long it would take for me to get, um, get to where you're going. I will tell you this. You fire it up and just find me on the map and say how many light years I am from you. Because if you tell it to plot a course, it will only plot up to 20,000 light years. So, and that won't get you from the bubble to the center of the universe. I told you about me exploding, didn't I? How did you explode? I thought I had logged out because I got kicked out of the game, you know, connection issues, whatnot. And I thought I had logged all the way out. And somehow I didn't log out. I left the computer running. We go, we worked on the house. I come back and it said, you know, and I looked and basically 20 hours later, I come in and it said I had exploded. So I'm actually got set all the way back to Morgan's Hole. That was the last place I had docked. I had lost like two weeks of exploring because I was on my way to the center and I'm like well something killed me I found the Thargoids out in the middle yeah something killed me yeah you know what killed me what the fact I had probably what I figured is when I got disconnected it actually put me back next to the star and I was throttled up, so I just cruised right into the star. Like a lemming. Because like I say, I hadn't, we'd gotten busy and I hadn't been on, on the computer in 20 hours, so yeah, boom. That made me so mad. I just turned it off. I looked at my computer and I said, I don't even want to look at your ass right now. I turned, I shut everything off. I was so mad. I was mad for a week. Annoyed at myself more, more than anything. And then I got back on here. I got back on here about two days after that. I said, all right, we're going to finish up what I was doing. And I made it to Sag A and now... I made it that far, I figured, well, kind of like Forrest Gump. I'd made it this far. Why not keep going? Listen, why is it taking him so long to put the... Uh, needs to be generated on first run of the game? Oh, wait, man, I bet you it's because I did a drive run update. I was sitting there taking a while to, uh... Yeah, spool up. It. Yeah. Have you updated your graphics card recently? Well, a month ago. Well, you ain't played it in a month, so... Still... A scanning. I don't think it'll be really annoying when somebody else comes out here. 
because my commander name is JD Youngblood. They're going to be like, who is this JD Youngblood guy? Why is he everywhere? My eventual goal, and I think it's obtainable, it'll take, huh? it'll take years. My eventual goal, Viper, is to see 100,000 systems. And this thing's got billions of them, so I figure I can see a hundred grand. Ain't like I ain't got anything better to do right now. Scan complete. Frameshift drive charging. Hey, six viewers. Thank y'all. Give me a follow if you want to. Mother plugger. Hey, yes, I am going to plug. Shamelessly plug myself. yourself who can you promote right what is the is the chihuahua growling again He'll get good in his sleep, and if something disturbs him, he wakes up in, you know, official Chihuahua mode. It's almost like I'm going for a completion, you know, achievement or something. We're, we're trying to scan everything down. If it was really a, if it was You're one like that, it'd be, you know, scan then map everything. And I tried doing that to start with. Where are you going, JD? A uh, Beagle Point. There you are. You are currently 50,162 light years from me. So, just a little bit then. Okay. You know, in space terms, you know, it's just a tad. Yeah. Now, I think in space trucking, that would also, I think that would be, yeah, that's a haul. Three, four thousand light years, that's just a hop, skip, and a jump. I did run across a planet. Ugh. 
a while back, and I should have bookmarked it, even though it was out in the middle of nowhere. Its gravity was like 8G. What's he doing? And Beagle Point is the furthest way? That's the furthest place that's got... That, that, that I know of that's got anything there. What's there? Um, nothing really. I don't know if they've put in a station or anything up there yet. But there is a beacon that you can go to, you know, and you scan the beacon and it tells you, hey, this is Beagle Point and yada yada yada. Oh, crap. Get myself adjusted here. Get comfortable. Another one down. Yeah, it won't let me route there. Oh no, you have to. Basically, you have to break it up into like. You have to go out 20,000 light years. Or, you know, 19,900 or something like that. Plot to there. Make it there. I just plot, it, plot out as far as you can. And tell me how many jumps that is. What's your question, buddy? You want some? You want something to eat? I'm a little hungry. I don't know what you got. A whole fridge full of stuff. And a freezer, too. Well, what do you know how to cook? You know how to cook hot dogs. Why will it not let me cancel the uh, trip? Is it still calculating? Well, no, I, 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 I marked it. Yes, you do know how to grill hot dogs. You are the grill master, Jason. You are the grill master of hot dogs. What, do I need my hat? Well, bring it here if you think I need my hat. See, maybe later, later tonight, JD. What was that, Chili? You're kind of quiet. I'll do tomorrow morning, mate. I'm calling it quits. All right, buddy. Thank you, JD. Oh, it needs to be on my head. All right. One of my sockets. Go put that up. Well, only one come out, so where'd the other one go? He hit sockets in my hat. Now, here's the other one. <clears throat> oh, that's an oddball size. 15, 30 seconds. Where did you find these? Tiny scissors. Okay, that was in your sewing kit? Okay. Oh, he found tiny scissors, y'all. The tiniest scissors known to mankind. All right. He does have a point. What are we having for lunch? Or dinner? You know what I'd like for supper tonight? Lasagna. <laughs> you can blame Viper. 
blowing up craving on it. You said you had lasagna and you didn't offer to bring me none. I don't give a crap you're 150 miles away. I want some lasagna. <laughs> It was that. What's the furthest you can go? Where, where it'll... What, distance-wise? Yeah. Uh, 20,000 light years. That's as far as it'll plot a route. Let's let's scan and see how many they are. We might get bored and go land on the planet. Let's just been oh god. Uh, I don't know. A week or two since I actually had my landing gear touch anything. And eh, not for eight geologicals, I ain't. I ain't waiting on that crap to finish. If I wait on every one of those to finish, then I will be at this for six months. System scan, complete. System scan is complete. Hey, sweetheart. Where did we happen to hide the cigarettes at? Behind my monitor? Not already. Yeah, the way I've got my stuff set up, I've got my big TV set up here for a monitor. And I've got it all slid up towards the front of the desk since I don't actually use the desk to sit at anymore since I've, you know, converted the recliner to a cockpit, basically. So everything gets set behind my monitor. So give me half a second, y'all. Oh, swing it over. Go. Yeah, I've actually got my joysticks and keyboard and everything set up on a platform so I can just swing it out and swing it back over. My daughter said it was lazy. I said it was efficient. Because before, if I wanted to get up, I had the joystick what? set on the arms of the recliner. I'd have to pick the joystick up, set it, then move the move the keyboard, slide the tray in on the desk, and then slide my chair back, and then get up. Now I just swing it over and I get up. Hey, and I'm on your world. I 
picked up another viewer. Appreciate it. What I should do is blast, blast Gibbons music while I'm doing this, you know what? He told me I could if I wanted to, so. Yeah, I mean, because I've got, uh, I, I should fail. People would probably enjoy that more than me running my mouth randomly about absolute crap. And Phil, you're welcome to get on Discord with us. You know, the world of Twitch might consider it, you know, you classing the join up with your accent. What you want to do, buddy? You want to play? Is it hooked up? Go, go fire it up and play it. Well, a very good evening, gentlemen. Hey, <laughs> going on, buddy? I'm here to class the place up, as you said. <laughs> yeah, might as well. <laughs> <laughs> you think my classy British accent will uh, drag some more viewers in for your epic uh, base voyage? <laughs> hey, it might. It just <laughs> might. Have you seen how far away I am from where I'm headed to, Phil? No. Well, when I get <laughs> when I get over here, I will. We get away from you know this huge ball of gas that wants to kill me. <laughs> <laughs> Viper just got a text. Was that what that was? <laughs> yeah, that was. <laughs> that was the sound when he gets a text. <laughs> or a phone call. I can't really remember. He used to have the red alert from Star Trek. That was. Nice. Yo, that was awesome. When, you know, when there'd be a lull <laughs> in the conversation. They're getting real quiet and everybody's starting to kind of, you know. Head starting to droop. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, watch this right here, Phil. Go right here, galaxy map. I am here. I'm going to there. <laughs> God. There's the center of the universe that I've already went through. Oh my god. 
down there's the bubble. Let's see here. See how far away I am from Earth now. I said that no fat fingers. I'm 50,393 light years from Earth. <laughs> Yikes. Yeah, and I still got, I think, scroll out here. It's bad when you have to scroll out and you have to wiggle this thing around. <laughs> yeah, I'm 15,000, still 15,000 light years from where I'm headed. Blimey. It's uh, 314 more jumps. <laughs> At basically 57 to 60, 000, 60 light years at a hop. Oh crap, hang on. I don't want to do that. I'm an idiot. I gotta scan the system first. And you're not worried about fuel because you've got um, you can recharge, can't you? Oh yeah, the, when the I way. go, Is that right? Yeah, when I when I fly around the stars, if they are the right class, I scoop I scoop fuel from the stars. Oh, okay, you've got scoops, right, right, right. Yeah, I know, I do remember. <laughs> it's been a long and, time since I played it, but I do remember the scoop. And I did on my scoop. I I don't know if you've seen the rate at which I scoop. It's when a, when it's maxed out on the scoopage, it, I'm scooping at like 878 units a second. I put the biggest freaking fuel scoop I could on this thing. I'm like, <laughs> I'm not hanging around a star and overheat. Yeah. <laughs> we're we're putting the biggest nozzle we can on this thing. Yeah. I think that was my problem. I remember like. Gibbon saying, oh, you go and get some fuel from this star. And I'd be there literally seconds. And the place would be, like, red hot. And I wouldn't get enough. Because I'd have to get away. My brother-in-law, when he first started playing, oh, my God, was that a comedy. <laughs> I wound up just... I wound up just going and following him. Because <laughs> basically we had him start system, leave the start system, head to us. Yep. And every time Does that planet there kind of in the middle where you can see the red kind of cratery area <laughs> Does that look like a, a gentleman's bit there? <laughs> <laughs> Kind of upside like down. The, on the lower right, kind of. Yeah. Yeah. Am I the, yeah. Am I the only one seeing that? Not just, no, not just you. <laughs> well, like, what life, the, what life the hell's finds collided? A way. <laughs> yeah, what the hell's collided with that in the past then? <laughs> I don't know, but I don't want to run into it to a dark alley. <laughs> I got. Uh. Thank you, Elite. That's just what I need. <laughs> <laughs> Crap. Hit the wrong button. Oh, Lord. Yeah, I was wondering if I was the only one, you know. <laughs> but yeah, when uh, my brother in law started. He didn't understand that you had to stay, you know in basically hyperdrive mm -hmm. to scoop from the stars. Yeah. So he would basically crash into the things and wonder why he wasn't picking up any fuel and why everything was overheating. <laughs> what you need, son? Uh get you got the remote to that to the T V? Okay, just Hit the input button, buddy. We got a Wii somewhere. 
and every so often he wants to play the Wii. Oh yeah. And then it's okay. Well, let's find all the hookups and everything. <laughs> or the wife will have it all hooked up, and then it's well, okay. Where are the controllers at? Oh yeah, we had we had the same issue when my my kids found that we've got a Wii because the wife and I had it before the long before the kids arrived. We were playing yeah. with it years ago when it first came out, like 2007, 2008, sort of thing. And um, I always kept it. I kept it in the box. I put it in the cupboard, and every time I moved, I've just gone into another cupboard and um, the kids found it a couple of years ago and they were like can we play it and I was like yeah we can hook it up you know all the games are pretty harmless so yeah and they absolutely loved it but that we were facing the same problem we'd, we'd they'd take a game out of the because it's all CD isn't it so they take a game out they just throw it to the side to change games they wouldn't put it back in the case so the next time they want to play the game it's all be fucking scratched and dirty yeah. Yeah. and they've just thrown it to one side well I don't have that problem with, with my youngins they put the games back up but they've got this habit of okay take take for instance the, you know the Xbox yeah okay they'll take a game out of the Xbox instead of putting it in the case that it goes into they put it into the case of the game that they just put into it. Put it in. Oh, yeah. See, at the end of the day, you've got a lucky dip of, uh, of games and cases. Dude, I've Could got one of those. In there. I've got one of those uh, little entertainment centers that, you know, oh, about three and a half, four foot wide. And all under that is all Xbox 360 games. <laughs> and I guarantee you I could go in there and pull just about anyone out. <laughs> And it would have the wrong disc in it. The wrong disc in it. <laughs> you know, there's something like 250 games laying there. Oh, God. <laughs> but, yeah, so. I know this is riveting entertainment here, watching me scan and <laughs> jump, scan and jump, but. It's either this or play Star Trek online, you know? <laughs> it's been so long since I played it, I don't know if they brought back, you know, the community-made missions. they had some of those the foundry I think is what they called it the foundry mission some of those were awesome I mean they were written better than some episodes of Star Trek you know oh really yeah they were some that were brilliant um there was one where you get caught in the time loop and you yeah about the third time you go through it you, you know, the second time all your characters are kind of, you know, Bridge Crew's kind of sitting there talking amongst themselves, and, you know, to you, it's like, haven't we done this? <laughs> Doesn't this feel, and by the third time, you know, you land on this admiral ship, and you go up there, and it's like, you do this, you do this, you do this. <laughs> and at the end of it, you know, it was one of these, like, no win type scenarios where. Right. You know, you're not supposed to be able to fight this stuff all. And my problem was, I built a hell of a tank. <laughs> so I could just whittle them down. So I'd eventually have to just basically sit there and just let myself die, to, you know, to, you know, to end the mission. But it was an awesome damn mission. It was it was a seriously a hell of a lot of fun. My f absolute favorite though. If Viper's here, he'll back me up. Admiral Bobo goes to war. 
It was completely silly. At one point, you bring out your, you know, you bring out your pet, and he's sitting there hitting the fire button for you. Yes. You can't get it? What's well, going on? Okay. You got the red and the red, the yellow and the yellow. Yeah, I need to come look. All right. I tell you what, y'all. I need to. I need to take a leak anyway. I'll be right back. <laughs> there we go. All right, be right back, y'all. I've got, I've got a, oh, crap. I got a weed to fix. I don't even know if y'all can still hear me or not. I am back. Welcome back. Took care of business and figured out why the Wii wasn't working. <laughs> the TV that we've got has got the uh, basically the component cables. Oh, and yeah. Instead of having like a separate one for like the old style where you got the yellow for video. It's got a green one, and on the <laughs> then on the label it says it shows it's also supposed to be the yellow. Oh God! Yeah, it's kind of like. Well, won't you just make the damn thing be you know <laughs> have a yellow ring around the outside of it or something? They didn't, but. I hooked it up and all is right in the world. So Phil, you still doing the radio gig or? No, <clears throat> I stopped doing that because my wife works, well, before all this shit started, she worked Saturday nights, so 
<laughs> you I just realized the, um, you just realized that you just became Alabamian there for about a, a half a second. Because <laughs> we don't call it, you know, the the pandemic or anything like that. We call it with all this shit going on. I don't know what. Yeah, it's 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 everything with all this shit going on. Yeah, so I kind of hung my headphones up and I said to the station manager, I said, look, I can't, my, things have changed at home, I can't really do this anymore, so I'm going to step away from a, for a bit, but I'll be back at some point. And she's like, fine, I'm sure we'll have something for you when you come back, so maybe later on in the year or next year or whenever oh, my wife fine. gets a job with sensible hours. Maybe I'll get, get a chance it. one of these years to... Uh... <clears throat> You know, call in to the station. <laughs> you know, call into the station and give you a hard time. Request free bird and <laughs> shit like that. <laughs> free bird! I played. I played for you, man. <clears throat> I know you did one time because I sent you, I said, was sending chaser messages while he was in the studio. Probably, yeah, that's, yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah. I was screaming across uh, South Dakota, you know, 75, 80 miles an hour in an 18 wheeler. <laughs> Basically, with it, with my phone hot spotted to my fancy tablet GPS, mm. and that run through the stereo of the truck. <laughs> nice. A little full blast then. I had the truck full blast, the stereo <laughs> full blast. And I'd try to tune in, you know, sometimes with hell, I'd always forget what damn time you were on. Eventually, I'll have my name all over the universe here. That's kind of my <laughs> <Yeah>. plan. Because <clears throat> you know how this works. If somebody else had been here before, it's say discovered by... Yep. Yep. <clears throat> I want to be as annoying as validating. <laughs> Would you all want to explain validating? I don't think so, no. Okay, you'll pop in like some places and you'll scan and it'll say discovered by validating. And you'll find this dude is everywhere. <laughs> validating is literally feels like everywhere you go. And I was sitting there I, <clears throat> trying to figure out who is validating. <laughs> Like, who is this guy, and how is he getting, ar getting around it? all of these places? <laughs> Finally, I figured I learned what it was. <laughs> Validating is like for the folks like on the Xbox or other, you know, other <laughs> systems. Yeah. And when they discover something, it just pops up and says, Validating. <laughs> but yeah, when you're sitting there first playing, you're like, this dude's every damn where. <laughs> I want to be as annoying as validating. <laughs> but I have a goal of 100,000 systems. I've got a long way to go, Phil. Yeah, man. <laughs> I want to say... I'm at... I think 4,000. I haven't checked. I can't remember the last time I looked if I was at 25, if I was at 3,500 or 2,500. I see, buddy. There's the last one. Tell you what, once I get out of this, I'll check. Okay, four. Let's see here. Codex. Stats. This will tell me. Okay. <clears throat> I 
I'm at 3,705 systems. Total, hey, total hyperspace distance is 144,000 light years. Price minute time played. Five weeks, seven hours, and 58 minutes. <laughs> God. And I got it in. January, I think. <laughs> I've actually passed Gibbon in hours played. Or no, I've passed Chaser in hours played by like a week and a half now. <laughs> Viper's being awful quiet. Probably taking a nap. <laughs> System scan complete. System scan complete. I'll be right back. No, he was awake. Just slow down and check. Nope. Drive charging. <clears throat> Three viewers. I think I'm one of them. Hey, Phil. Let's fill it right back. Hey, go, man. I'm here. Hey. <clears throat> I'm gonna try something real quick. All right. And I might need you to unfollow me and then refollow me. Okay. To see if this works. <laughs> okay. Let me get away from here. All right. I need. Enjoy the view of whatever's going to show up. Probably my right. <laughs> Okay, because... Let's see here. On this screen here... Oh, that's... That's all for me. That's, that's everything. That is not what we want to see. <laughs> Back here. Okay. Do, 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 do. Alert box. Yes. Add source. Awesome. I gotta go in here. Follows. Yes. Let's see here. Media. Okay. Done. All right. Okay, fail. Yo. If you don't mind. Unfollow me. Done. Okay, now refollow me. All right, let me refresh Twitch. Okay, hang on a second. Let me one before you refollow me. Let me do one thing here. Okay. Let me. Go. Oh crap! I hate when it does that. There we go. Let me go back here. Alert box. Let me go here. Test widgets. Follow. <laughs> is that your follow tag? <laughs> yeah, okay, that is my follow tag. I want to see now if you follow. Let me get so back if, in the if game. If I here. follow you now, if it comes yeah, up. Yeah, I want to see if it All comes right. up. Clicked it. 
okay? <laughs> it might not, since you're already following me. That's what I thought. If I unfollowed and refollowed, I don't know if it does that again or not. Alright. Hey, sweetheart, stay Nick in here. Come here, buddy. Bring your phone. We're going to see if this right here works. <laughs> Come here, bud. I need a favor of you. <clears throat> I'm trying to make sure. You got your Twitch on your phone? No, I want you to follow me because I want to see if this works. Okay, we'll pull up. There. Let me get it pulled up. Let me see. Was that you, the fire whatever guy? Yeah. Alright, let's see if we can get an actual follow out of you. Freak? Freakerson. It's all together. Yeah, well, I'm, I'm live right now. You gonna say hey to the world? There you go. Say hey to the world, Nick. Bye. All right, well, here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I just said to be quick. Um, I Let me see it. All right. Let me play with it. <clears throat> it says following. Oh, you're already following me. That's right. That's good then. Oh, that stinks. No, hang on. Nope. What is that? Wait, is your thing on right now? Yes. Nope. You, you need... I know, but if you go like that... You no, know, you need to put another freak in it. Oh. It's freak, Freakerson. My bad. Hang <laughs> on. There we go. There we go. Yeah, I could have... I was at your live thing. Wait. Yeah, but okay. Now I'm looking at, I'm looking at me, looking at your phone, looking at me, looking at your phone. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah. Just leave it on there. Yeah, there you are. Okay, now try to follow me. If this doesn't work, you're going to go make Emily a Twitch account. <laughs> We're going to make sure this works. <laughs> it does sound good and clear, though. Let's hope on the stream. Last night when I first started, dude, everything was robotic. I've got one video that's five minutes long of me just yelling at the computer. <laughs> <laughs> well, that sucks. I guess. Go make, go make a new Twitch account. <laughs> Try it. Right, you probably just blinded everybody. Yeah. Everything is gone. Hey, Dad. I'm going to ride. 
You're going to ride? Yeah. How'd you do on your map? I'm so What'd you make? Okay, as long as you're passing. Oh, please don't make that noise. Oh my god. God, what is it? I'm just look watching that video you put in the chat. Which video? The 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 guy, the Mexican guy with the firework. Oh my God, was that not awesome? Fuck me! I was like, what? So you had the same reaction I did. I freaking lost it. <laughs> Everybody runs, believe, the camera but... goes black, you don't know if people are yeah. dying or not. That went that went to naught to holy shit in about three seconds. Have you ever seen <laughs> the one where the black guy sets off all the fireworks? <laughs> the guy in the wheelchair. Yeah, oh back up, God. Terry! Back don't up. reverse, Terry! <laughs> yeah, I love I'm... that one. I, I love don't... that one. Yeah. Back up, Jerry! Oh, look out, Jerry! Oh my God! <laughs> the, Every... the, the other one well, hits I... in the middle of the night, and they set off as massive amounts of fireworks. And the dude recording it is like, "Oh Lord! Oh Jesus! Help me!" <laughs> I mean, he's screaming like hell because just everything's blowing up around him. And then once everything gets done blowing up, he's like, "Yeah, that wasn't nothing." <laughs> Oh, I cracked up. He's screaming his <laughs> ass off. Uh, pardon me. Hey, sweetheart. I'm hungry. You're all hungry. Yeah, I know, but seriously, I'm starting to get a headache type hungry. Did you whoop me up something? Like, I don't, don't care. Don't tell me nothing. Or you don't care. <laughs> okay, that amount of damn screaming ass noise of shit falling was the cat jumping and sliding into the back of my monitor <laughs> and then he got his then he got one of his nails caught in the back of the TV I just about had a TV in my lap <laughs> you realize I would have killed the cat you know that right no you wouldn't have look that 50 cent cat Ain't worth my four hundred dollar TV. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, I like Fred. Right. <laughs> I would have threw shoes at him though. That's the cat that I told y'all earlier was mildly retarded. That's fine. She needs. She needs some. She's done. All her finals are done. All her finals are done. Yes, she's done for. The other season's at nine thirty. Awesome. But yeah, I don't really. It doesn't really matter what you make. But you know what I'd like? What? I'd like for you to go to the store and get some lasagna for tonight. <laughs> you know that. Two hours. I know. 
I know if you went and got it and we put it on now in two hours, we could have a lasagna. But for right now, I'll take. Slowed out. Okay. How about a Polish sauce? Hang on, don't throw that either. Oh, we ate the last. Okay. Shit, you Alrighty. Hey, we'll eventually get. Biologicals and geologicals. Do you want to go there? Do what? If you find a planet with bios and geos, do you want to go there? Sure. Just check the gravity rating on the planet. Gravity one one point zero two G's. Okay, you're good. You're good up to about four, really. Did you ever call Charlene back? You want me to call Charlene? You want? I told you it'd be tomorrow. She told me it would be today. Well, I told you that they lied to you and it'd be tomorrow. Yeah. Hey, get some of that garlic bread stuff that you get. Yeah. I go find a garlic bread and some lasagna. Ooh, that sounds good tonight. Ooh, yeah, I could go with some garlic bread. Now see, now we're actually going to go get actual, you know, like the big Texas toast garlic bread, you know. I know what you mean, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Not, see, normally if we say we're having garlic bread, you know what that means? What's that? We're going to take a piece of loaf bread. Yeah. We're going to put no. butter on it and some yeah. garlic salt. Because <laughs> look, <laughs> down here we, where I grew up at, loaf bread... It's for sandwiches. Yep. It's for hot dogs. It's for hamburgers. It can be cinnamon toast. It can be, you know, garlic bread. It can be regular <laughs> toast. I mean, it's just... It's the way it is. So you'll do the, um... Uh, with, with the loaf bread, you... you... You beat some eggs, dip it in the egg, and then fry it. Fry it up. French toast. French toast, yes. Oh man, that's good stuff. <laughs> <laughs> it is. But it has to be. It has to be cooked right. Yeah. Because. I never was a huge fan of French toast because I don't think I've ever had it cooked right. Okay. What you doing, love? And here we go. I could just start jumping, 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 and hurry up and get there, but eh, I like doing it this way. I did make my channel for mature audiences. Just for the fact that I smoke. We find pictures of penises on planets. <laughs> here the other night when I told Chaser that we all need to get together and play damn Dungeons and Dragons? Yeah. <laughs> we should. We freaking should. I've never played it. I've always wanted to play it. You know. But trying to find a group down here in Alabama to play Dungeons and Dragons. <laughs> especially when it was popular. Yeah. 
Dungeons and Dragons is the devil. <laughs> Let's get accused of being a massive geek if I wanted to play Dungeons and Dragons. I don't care. Call me whatever. <laughs> Good lord, I'm sitting here <laughs> scanning planets in a video game. <laughs> I don't think you can get much geekier than that. Oh, I don't know. You throw some Dungeons and Dragons in the mix. You might be, uh, you yeah. know. I could. Start collecting, I could play. Uh, I could play Dungeons and Dragons from the cockpit of my spaceship. <laughs> yeah. Have you, you seen collect... my setup, Phil? Uh, yeah. I think. Um, I think uh, Blade Chaser might have sent me a picture, or it might be in in the Discord somewhere up above. What you did I... to your recliner. Here, I'll do this. Turn around. That's my <laughs> setup right there. And I screwed in that little piece of board there to mount the yeah. to mount the webcam to. <laughs> nice. But yeah, everything's everything's on a swivel, <laughs> so it swivels out of my way. Nice. Let's see here. There we go. And the way I keep the webcam mounted to it. Here, I'll hold it right here so I can show you. Clamp. <laughs> Clamp the bracket. <laughs> Just as easy as that. <laughs> hey, you know. Boy, that's cricketer and shit. There we go. Now oh, that's straight <laughs> enough. I'll leave it a little crooked for you know for my gay friends. <laughs> they don't laugh. One of my best friends is a gay guy from New York. He's also the one who I consider to be the godfather of my children. All right. You don't hear very many rednecks say, yeah, my kid's godfather is a gay guy. <laughs> well, that's true. You know, I, we convinced him to move to Alabama. From New York? From New York to Alabama. He wasn't real sure to start with. You know? Yeah, I bet. <laughs> he He's wasn't probably real more sure. The customs of city living and stuff. Well, he got down here. And he came to visit a couple of times, you know, before he, before he decided to move. And he come down here, and he's like, um... We went to Walmart, just walking through Walmart, and everybody, you know, local Walmart, you go by, you go through there, and everybody, you know, as you walk through, people go, hey, how you doing? Yeah. Or, you know, if they need to get bathed, they'll go, hey, excuse me. <laughs> you know, just good southern raisin, you know, just manners. <laughs> yeah. And he goes, why the hell is everybody so nice down here? <laughs> so, dude, that's the way we are. <laughs> you know, that's exactly the way we are down here. <clears throat> and, uh, KD's in the background going, in America! <laughs> yes, we do, buddy. I and suppose between... Like it, I suppose between you and me, I got friends in Ohio. And we've got, I say we, my family, my dad especially, has got an, a, a, a good friend of his and an ex-business partner in um, Minnesota. So that's still up there in the Yankee country. Yeah, yeah. That's way up there in Yankee Town. But, um, yeah, but he also, he got to talking to folks down here and meeting folks down here. and He's like, nobody really seems to care that I'm gay. Yeah, that's the other thing. It's like, when they when you talk about Southern hospitality, people think it's a bit of a myth, or it's only in movies, but he's clearly that's not the case. Oh, hell no. We have a, th we have a saying at my house. You come down here to visit, 
If you leave hungry, it's your own damn fault. <laughs> that's, how, that's how I was raised. My grand, my grandfather. Um, it's what my grandfather taught me. Nobody leaves your fire hungry. Yeah. And, and plain and simple, that's the way it's always been. Uh, no one, no one should leave your fire hungry. Yeah, that's right. I mean, hell, you come down around my house, hell. We don't have a whole lot, but everything we got, we hell, we freely give. <laughs> you hungry? Eat. You Always sleepy? Get more. There's a couch. <laughs> Yeah, but he just couldn't believe over how people actually were down here. <laughs> and uh, one of the guys in our car club, you know, kind of, you know, figured out that, you know, he was gay. And, he, and he's like, you know what? He goes, I'm not. But I don't give a damn if you are. And one of the funniest lines he ever said to Prime was he had done something for the club or something. And old Jeff goes, you know, John, I love you just as much as a straight man can love another, another man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's funny as hell. He's like, I get treated better down here than I did up here. <laughs> still love the nickname that uh, JD gave him. Oh, God, yes. <clears throat> he was down here one day, and we're working on something. And Prime is the type he doesn't like to have get his hands dirty. You know, he doesn't like <laughs> getting his hands dirty. He doesn't want them to stay dirty, you know? <laughs> so as I'm done, i got to go wash my hands. Oh, we're out there, and we're standing out there next to his truck. JD's in the bed of his truck, playing in the bed of the truck. And he sees his hands are dirty. He starts, you know, wiping his hands off. And I looked at him, and I said, Dude, quit being such a princess. And my son, <laughs> who was six at the time, looked at him and said, Yeah, Uncle Princess. <laughs> Instant nickname. Instant nickname. <laughs> For Christmas, we got him this pink goblet that was about yay tall, <laughs> about this big around, rhinestones around the top, <laughs> the gaudiest damn thing on the face of the planet. It said princess on it. <laughs> the guy who painted his car called me up. Because John was getting his Trans Am painted. The guy calls me up. He goes, hey, man, I had a sticker made to go on his car. <laughs> and he didn't know Prime that well. He goes, um, I want to put it on there. He goes, but I don't know if he'd get offended. And I'm like, what does it say? He goes, it's chrome, and it says fabulous. <laughs> to go up beside the vents on the Ram Air hood, but it's supposed to say Ram Air. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like, if you don't put it on there, I'm going to be mad at you. <laughs> John seen it, and he's like, he loved it. <laughs> he thought it was the greatest thing ever. He thought it was, seriously, he thought it was the greatest thing ever, and they're still on the car. He's like, no, those those stay. Those stay until ever until I get it repainted, then I'll get them. <laughs> Another set made just like it. Why would he get it repainted? Because he's planning on keeping it forever. The hell Hello, Duke. Come in here, sniff my toe and go away? Is that what we're doing? But hell, he keeps the thing in a garage, so.
<clears throat> oh my god, cat, get down. You're about to knock all of that crap over, aren't you? Tell the cat you're about to see your you're about to test the nine lives theory. Oh, she's she's kind of special. <laughs> All of our cats are kind of special. She's the one that's about the half the size half the size of a normal cat, and I think that's going to be about as big as she gets. We've got another one that she basically lives in the garage because she doesn't like the other cats and she doesn't like being inside she loves everybody else she's the one that walks up to you and start when you start petting her she starts drooling on you like a <laughs> saint bernard that was disgusting but she's purring the whole time you know it's like hey eh, kitty you're all right But yeah, like I say, I think this little cat here was tossed out a little, little bit. Let's say little bit was tossed out. Duke was abandoned, the dog. Hey, Amber, stop. Pick up Duke real quick. Hey, Phil. What's up? Pick him up and hold him. Come here. I want to show you. Oh, here. That's Duke. All four pounds of him. Oh, little Duke. Dukester. He, he's like, okay, I don't like being held. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> All right, I'm good with that. <laughs> but that's Duke. He's a... Get her Twizzlers, Duke. I don't know what exactly what a Twizzler would do to a Chihuahua. <laughs> but I don't want to clean up the mess afterwards. No. But yeah, he uh, he was abandoned. Our dog, at, our dog Smokey, she, well, the neighbor's dog had puppies, so... We wound up with her. <laughs> kind of one of those things. And there's Sandy. Our other dog. She showed up as a puppy. Somebody had dumped her out. It's like, we're the magnet for the animals. Mm-mm. At one point, when we lived up in Boaz, we had something like 18 cats. Oh, Lord. We started finding them homes, though. Yeah. <laughs> well, put it this way. One, we had five kitties. And then we woke up one morning, and five kitties had turned into 12. And then three days later, <laughs> the 12 kitties turn into 18. <laughs> and the second one, she was so fat and hairy, you didn't even know she was pregnant, you know? <laughs> Until, pop, here comes all the kitties. That's the reason all of ours now, with exception a little bit, fixed. And then we're going to send this. We were waiting until she got big enough, but she's old enough now, so it's just going to be. We just got to take her to the vet and get it done. Hmm.
I'm out here in the middle of nowhere, and I just went to go see if my my super cruise uh, guide was off. Was yeah. Not. But for some reason, when I come into systems, I have to hit the X button, or I keep flying toward the sun. Well, when I go in, it'll say hyperspace throttle engage, the throttle engaged. Does yours say that? It's on, but hold on, I'll, I'll check. I'm about to go to the next system. Yeah, if you leave it in a throttle up position, you're definitely going to fly straight to the sun. The one time I leave my phone in the damn kitchen, mm -hmm. he called. And now I can't call him back. Call him right back. I can't. If you have an emergency, stay on the line for the next operator. I don't have an emergency. Stay on the line. Tell him the doctor just called and you're trying to, you're trying to return his call. what I got. Told you, loaf bread is a hamburger bun, too. <laughs> I got a cheeseburger. I think I've done that one <laughs> with bread. <laughs> Every th loaf bread is, you know, be used for anything. Oh, it's so good. <laughs> Gee, when I was a kid, loaf bread was even baked. Sometimes I just like it toasted with loads of butter on it. Mm -hmm. Just oh, eat yeah, toast. <laughs> Sometimes I like to just lay a slice of cheese over it. Yeah, it says <laughs> it says hyperspace dethrottle engaged, but it's not dethrottle. Oh well, then that's the hyperspace. Yeah, you got to pull your throttle back to zero, or you'll keep going towards a star. What are you doing over here, dog? Yes, I got a cheeseburger. I want some cheeseburger. <laughs> Listen, he'll start whining here in a second. He's already starting a little bit. What? What? Tell you what I'll do. Here, have a breadcrumb. <laughs> Trying to eat without smacking in y'all's ear. <laughs> oh, Blaches doesn't give a shit. He can he can he can destroy a packet of crisps, a big packet of crisps, on the microphone and not give a shit. Well, I'm getting a cheeseburger and it's smack 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 smack. <laughs> That's why I went away for a little bit because I just ate a, <laughs> but you know. And didn't have my teeth in, so yeah, that was a trick. I'm lucky with my headset that I can, if I push the microphone out of the way, it mutes it. <laughs> so I just push it up if I want to eat something. <laughs> well, I'm sitting here well, with a camera on, so. <laughs> wow, that's true. <laughs> I'll give him a minute, see if he can call you back. Did you leave a message? <laughs> Where did you, you say you left your phone in the kitchen? Bread crumb. I toss him the edges off the bread. Dude, you know he wants meat, cheese, and sauce, don't you? <laughs> not, not your uh, scraps of bread. <laughs> Let them eat scraps. <laughs> well, his little ass is getting scraps. Because <laughs> this is my cheeseburger. You're giving him the edge of the bread? Yeah. <clears throat> it's literally, let him eat cake. Uh, Trust me, that little turd eats better than we do. <laughs> it's usually the animals in the house eat better than the uh, 
the people. <laughs> Don't you sit over here and look at me and whine. You done had two pieces. Two big pieces. Waggy, 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 waggy. <clears throat> hey, baby. This cheeseburger is excellent. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, my wife. Miss, I can't take a compliment. Mm -mm. Here, there's you one more. Give it in piece off this one. Yes, y'all, riveting entertainment of me eating. I thought for a second your view count had gone up, but... <laughs> <laughs> I've got three! I don't believe one of those is me. That's m me, me and Viper are the other ones then. <laughs> I guess so. <laughs> but hey, you gotta start somewhere. Absolutely. I haven't even broadcast, you know, linked it on Facebook or anything. What dog? What dog? What was it he got of yours, Amber? Didn't he get into something of yours and run off with it one day? Food-wise? <clears throat> No, he didn't run off with it. He basically got in the middle of it. Your uh, mashed potatoes, wasn't it? Yeah. <laughs> but you were done with them. No, you weren't, were you? No, I just ate. Oh, she had just made a plate. Of... Amber likes to eat mashed potatoes. Sometimes that's just what she wants. She made a big old plate full of mashed potatoes. <laughs> Set it down, come in, and the dog is basically in the middle of it. <laughs> oh, Lord. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that was the day that Amber decided she did. She wanted to get rid of the dog. I was going to say, did he live outside for a bit? <laughs> oh, no, no. summertime why the hell is it back what's that I think it's a squirrel or two squirrels in my attic put some mothballs up there they'll leave I can't get my ass up there dude <laughs> they're a pain in the ass when they come in your house so I fail. Yep. You see that? A little bite of hamburger meat? Yeah. Here, Duke. Come here. Thank you. There you go. Now, look, it's there you all go, gone. Duke. All it gone. It wasn't now. just bread. There you go, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> it's all gone. Oh, you liked that, didn't you? <laughs> I like the cheese hot dogs. And I'll be sitting there eating one. He'll sit there and look at me. I'll pinch off little pieces of the cheese hot dog and feed it to him. <laughs> and then I realize, hey, those cheese hot dogs are like $5 a damn pack. Oh, God. <laughs> and the dog just helped me eat half a pack of cheese dogs. <laughs> that is why I buy hot dogs for us. And uh, my dog actually gets hot dogs as treats. And I'll buy the, 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 the bar S packs. For, yeah, you know, ninety-seven cents for a pack of hot dogs. Now go see Amber now. 
got you got fed. Now you get up there and love on Amber. I have no more food for you. Don't sit there and look at me like that. Go tell Amber you want a cheeseburger. That's Amber, your daughter, Mom. Did you hear that? You want a cheeseburger? Actually, the funniest damn thing was the night when I looked in and I go, we're having tacos, and I'm like, you want a taco? <laughs> and this little dude right here went nuts. <laughs> he looked like damn happy feet, man. He's sitting there just a dancing tail wagon. <laughs> and Amber, when she makes, well, she, basically she makes me like burritos, bean and beef, uh, you know, the seasoned hamburger meat, refried beans, and cheese. That's what I like on my, yeah. you know, my burritos. Yeah. But the thing is, Bill, they'll be about this damn long, and seriously, <laughs> that damn big around. Yeah. They weigh the probably two I made, pounds. I made Doritos tonight. They weren't as big as that because I had to feed the kids as well, so they were a bit smaller, but they were good. Well, she makes those things. They weigh about, oh, pardon me. Compliments to the chef, maybe. <laughs> yeah. Well, she made these things, and um, I ate till I was absolutely stuffed. <laughs> and uh, hell, I still probably had a piece of that burrito, you know, three inches long or so, <laughs> three inches around, like half a beer can. <laughs> and I set it down on the floor for him. I turned around and everything was gone in about 45 seconds. <laughs> everything. They wasn't a drop of juice on the plate, nothing. <laughs> he likes some tacos, burritos. Yeah, he, he's honestly one of the... I've owned a head a couple of chihuahuas growing up when I was younger. And... My favorite, you know, one of the, I had two growing up. And my favorite one, I had him from like when I was six or seven up until I was like 18. And he wasn't a puppy when I got him. He was an older dog when I got him. Mm. And he was great. He was a great little dog. But playful wise, Duke's got him beat. <laughs> Duke's very young. We don't think Duke's been about a year old. We took him to the vet. They said they said he is what, about a year old, baby? And he is playful as all get out. Alright, let's go to the next one. Some said it running my mouth. 304 jumps. I'm doing 315 jumps. No shit. No, no, I'm uh, I'm heading out to one of the uh, one of the markers. Which I'm marker are you headed to? Uh, Brew Hypus KST 331. Is that the ones that like makes a line towards Colonia? I think so. But it also kind of makes a line out there to where you're going. That might be. Was there any notes on that one? Let me check mine real quick. And you said what now? Um, KSD something other. Oh, oh, where am I going? KSD. Jesus.
It's either bone base or blue base. I can't remember. Which okay, one yeah, that's one of the bases that they put in on the trip up to uh, Colonia. Yeah, that's one thing I didn't go to was none of those bases because <clears throat> I actually left out from uh, <clears throat> crap Morgan's Hole. The blue base. You know what? I think I'm going to there. I think I'm gonna get off here. You've going you've only got three hundred and fifteen jumps ahead of you. Yeah, I know. But I can You gonna disappear for another month? Oh, I'll get back on fly on. Alright, bud. <clears throat> right yeah. now we World of Tanks has got missions on it that gives us. They, this is the week when it starts to get it, uh, and you have to do a bunch of missions to get a key. And if you get three keys, you get a 3D camo style for um, one of a tier nine tank. Okay, cool. And right now, I'm all about everything free. I mean, you both, dude. The only thing I have, you know, other than spending money on the house, is, well, I donated a dollar to Chaser's stream yesterday. Or should I say a dollar twenty-seven because of the exchange rate. What is that, a shilling? <laughs> well, the joke was... Yeah, the joke was I had popped his donation cherry. And since it's a pound, I had gave him a pounding. Yes, and that's just as bad as it sounds. Phil, I appreciate you tuning in. You too, Viper. Hey, Viper, if I ain't gonna kill your bandwidth, leave it on. <laughs> I need all the view. I need. I need to keep three viewers. <laughs> Cause they've got it done up some you know you got certain milestones you gotta hit you know certain achievements how long, how long am i gonna be on no idea it really depends you know until i get just absolutely bored out of my mind which you know I grew up as an only child so I'm used to entertaining myself or until the wife says hey we need to do this or until she looks at me and goes hey we need to do this back I'm sorry that happens. Yeah, the stream goes off. I don't. I don't think. I don't think Twitch needs to see that. Get a few more viewers if you start streaming that. <laughs> yeah, and for about five minutes until everybody goes. Yep. Report. That's the, not the kind of streaming you know. I think that Amber wants to do. <laughs> she said nope. Hey, what if it was making us 20 grand a month? <laughs> Would you want to do it then? Nope. 20 grand a month, I'll do it myself. 
she let you uh, would she let you get a girlfriend so you can make twenty grand a month? She said as long as she ain't got to do it. <laughs> One of the funniest conversations that's ever been held in this house, dude. We were sitting there one night on the couch. Or her and her friend was in there sitting on the couch, and I'd come back here to play games or whatever. And, you know, I mess with Amber because, you know, she's got, she's got a friend over, so, you know. Turn up the pervert factor to 10, right? Oh, yeah. And her friend was kind of joking back with me. You know, we're all sitting there. You know, we're both kind of carrying on back and forth. Amber was carrying on a little bit. And finally, she, she, her friend said, I'm a, yeah, what was it? She said, I'm about to go back there and take care of that. Or something like that. And Amber goes, if you can keep him off of me for 15 fucking minutes, I would be great. <laughs> I'll let y'all's imagination take over after that point. <laughs> And Phil, that's the reason that Chaser says I live in a different dimension from y'all. <laughs> Dukester, I have no food. You've been sitting there this whole time looking at me, waiting <laughs> on me to drop something. I have nothing to drop for you. Tell you what, I'll make Amber happy. Come here, little buddy. Here. You want to lick the barbecue sauce off the plate? <laughs> Yes, he does. <laughs> the answer to that question was yes. <laughs> First time I did that, Amber looked at me and she goes, So you're just not going to use that plate no more? And I said, No, you're going to wash it. I said, I'm just looking at it this way. You don't have to scrape nothing down the damn, you know, off in the trash can. <laughs> Fuel scooping. Fuel scooping complete. Fuel scooping complete. What kind of games do you play now, bud? Hmm. Uh, <clears throat> bit of everything, really. And nothing. Play a lot of um, Call of Duty Warzone. That's cool. I've never really been into the first-person shooter games. No. I, I tend to dip in and out a little bit. Let me have a look. Play the odd sim. Quite fond of, I'm quite partial to farming simulator. Would you believe? Farming simulator? Farming, yeah. Like Farmville? No, this is where you're driving no. the tractors around and stuff, dude. Yeah, yeah. this is um, made by Giant Software. The sim's actually quite good. You know, it's quite uh, detailed. Phil, have you seen the controller you can buy for farming simulator? I have, yeah. The wheel and the stick and the, the it's got buttons. got the little stick and... and the buttons and all that. Yeah. Yep. It's crazy. Crazy. I was honestly thought about buying that and setting it up <laughs> for when I'm doing the scanning. I could just sit there with a little stick. But yeah, I, I play can't... a lot. Um, yeah, I play a lot of Call of Duty. I, I play... Bits of um, DCS, you know the flight sim. I really Do thought I about getting the free download of that. Yeah. What is it? A DCS. Digital Combat Simulator. It's it's a it's a it's a flight sim, um, but you you buy each um, each plane you want to fly. You have to buy as a separate module. 
and they're like between 50 and 60 dollars some of them are cheaper they just had a big um quarantine event where everybody was on lockdown they gave you a chat they opened their entire catalog for you to try two weeks so every single aircraft was unlocked and they got a lot of aircraft i've got the um the a10 oh, a10c the thunderbolt pack you got the warthog the, yeah, got the Warthog cap, got the F-14 Tomcat, the yep. F-15 Eagle, um, and when you buy it, I think you get two. Um, you get, I know a, you get a, a, a. You get a Russian, a Russian jet, and the P-51D, which is the training plane rather than the war plane. Yeah, you get a P-51 Mustang. Yeah. With no guns. No guns. No, that is the D. Yeah. The trainer. So that's good. So I play that every now and again. Um, you don't have the Spitfire. Nope. I don't think they've got. They haven't got a uh, Spitfire model. Ever. Go, go, go get Nick Penley. Okay. Let's see if he comes there and plays with him. To be honest, I've been really um, lazy with my games lately. I've been too busy, <laughs> too busy watching other people play their games on their computers. Because <laughs> 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 I'm just waiting for mine to be built. So, because I ordered, an, I've ordered a brand new PC, which arrives on Thursday. Well, Thursday, get everything. Once you get, for the Friday, after you've gotten everything set up, jump on here. Oh God, yeah. Hell, well, I I don't know so if I'm my... gonna, I don't know if I can buy Farmville or anything. But... <laughs> yeah, no, I I mean I've got Elite Dangerous installed, so I can just I don't even have to pay for Elite for a bit. The thing is, I've never been able to play anything on Ultra settings or even high settings. You know, you sh mine's not top of the line by any stretch. But look up the Skytech Archangel. That's what I bought. And I did bump the RAM up to 16 gigs. And that's all I did. Okay, yeah. That with the 1050 in it, 1050 Ti. 1050 Ti in it. Yeah. Um, the only reason I got this thing is because I was still using the one that they built me and the, the guys built for me in the freelancer days. Oh, blimey. Okay. Dude, this thing was, it was 10 but years this old. Like, this is like mine. Mine's 10 years old. And I've just, I've just, all I've done is I've had the case, um, you know, Gibbon's friend, Chili. So he gave me he gave me a new he's recently gave me a new case and a <laughs> a 750 Ti. <laughs> I'm running eight gigs of RAM, but only seven and a half or seven point eight are actually showing on the on the device manager. I've got an i5 4690. So yeah, I've, yeah, it's a spud. It is a real spud. But. I I played on that thing, and you know it would still run Stow and you know stuff like that. Uh, I have been amazed at what this what this machine has run. All right, on shitty settings, but I've managed to keep up with you know the guys that have got the bigger and better system. Yeah, but I was able to run it on really good settings on Stow and yeah. stuff. So, so there's some so there's some games on here that sometimes we play we're dipping and out of that like Warframe managed to play that on really good like that that looked really nice on here on on like d good you know decent settings um, uh, we've just got I've just got the the Xbox the Game Pass you know for PC yeah um, and we've started playing um, Sea of Thieves and that ran really nice on here as well. 
I was playing DayZ for a while. They, yeah, this runs on on, uh, on quite nice on on here as well. But then I um, I started a, um, a a members or a founders um, I paid like four ninety nine a month for um, GeForce Now. Yeah. So it's basically I can play I can play Daisy, um, the Division. Uh, what else? Squad, like Armor 3, Rainbow Six, load of others. But on, um, if I own the game, I can run it through GeForce now. I can run it through NVIDIA's remote servers. And they've got, like, top notch graphics cards on them. So they, they run, I think they've got, like, half a dozen servers in Central Europe. And as long as I own the game. I can log on to one of these servers and play these games at higher spec than my computer will because uh, it's all on their server side. It's really good. That's, that is cool. No, but Phil, the only reason I was actually able to get this computer is because I was on Amazon and I'm scrolling looking for computers because I'm like, I need a damn computer. <laughs> Badly. Because mine got the point it was blue screen. Yeah, the hard drive started dying. Then the the motherboard just abs finally absolutely just went slap out, and I was like, "Well, crap!" And I'm sitting there scrolling on Amazon one day, and I run across this thing, and it was you know last year's model. Yeah, and it was like, "Buy it now." Payments, no credit check, no interest. <laughs> Um, it's like a hundred and twenty-seven dollars down, and that took care of all the taxes and everything. All right. And then it was like a hundred dollars a month for five months. Or it might have been a hundred twenty dollars a month for five months. So have you got the A? Have you got? Is it the one with the AMD processor in it? Uh, I believe so. Because I'm looking at it, I went into Amazon here, and it's not available. You can't buy it. You can't buy it. <laughs> yeah, of course not. It's unavailable. But <laughs> yeah, it's got the it says it's got the AMD FX 6300 in it, and um, the GeForce GTX 1050 Ti, the, the four gig one. Did you get the one with the, the one terabyte hard drive in it? Yes, I have the terabyte hard yeah, drive. Good one. Yeah. And I think, hang on a second. All right, I gotta alt tab out of the game for a moment. I'll just do this. Keeps that pulled up good, so nobody can see what I'm doing. <laughs> Let me pull this over here. I know what I'll do. I'll just go look on Amazon real quick. And my past orders. should still be in there you know they never take that stuff off Oh, here we go. Yeah. Um, got the... The Ryzen 1203... No, it's a Ryzen uh, 3.1 gigahertz quad core. Uh, what is a fuel star for? That is the last place... That you can fill up along your route before you run out. <laughs> but if you're get, filling up as you go, it keeps popping up, you know, one jump further. 
but just keep your eye on the way you're going. Make sure you're going to fuel stars. Well, the way I'm going, I see this fuel star. It's uh, about four jumps away one. Yeah, but you're feeling up off every star, ain't you? Yeah. Yeah, then it, you'll notice it'll move. It does. It hasn't yet. Okay. Well, that might be the one that you need to fill up at because you're going to run into an area where, like I did, I went through five or six jumps that weren't, you know, weren't fuelable. One time I made a jump and I was like, it told me, hey, fuel level low. I don't have to make the next jump. And I was actually able to make one that was like 10 light years, but it was a the correct star type. <laughs> it's something you got to keep an eye on when you start getting way the hell out. running out this far out that's you've got to start putting in a call to the field rats and that's something you know I'm really glad that them guys are around it's really cool that you know there's a group of players who will come out and basically rescue your ass yeah, but will they come out even on a private server like this? Oh, you can log in. You can log in, you know, to open. This far out, ain't nobody going to be out here, you know? And meet up with them, you know, and that's their whole deal. You know, they come out and take, you know, help take care of the players that have screwed up and run out of fuel. Something else I've also learned is check the stars in the system because sometimes you'll be in a system that you jump into and it, you jump in the star that you jump next to you can't feel off of. But there'll be one in that system where all you got to do is fly over to it and go scoop up the fuel you need. It'll be the right time. And another one down. And the way we go. How long have I been streaming? What is that up there? Two and a half hours, mate. Awesome. back open so if I want a red Gatorade I need to come in there and get it I might just have to go shopping at JD's store again got this little plastic kitchen set and he likes to set up a, he likes to have a store <laughs> He says he's open until dark. <laughs> but that's when he closes us at dark. Fair enough. You do get top notch service though, I won't say that. <clears throat> so now you have to pay the help, huh? Yeah. But it's still that it's still that cute. Just pretend you're handed money deal. He's still happy with that. Yeah, 
tell you what, guys. I will be right back. Let me hit that, as a matter of fact. I'll hit the be right back screen. Oh. Phil, you ever played World of Tanks? Phil? What's that, mate? You ever, you ever played World of Tanks? Um, yeah, like, ages ago, yeah. How long's in it? Ages ago. I mean, it's been out for ten years, so. Yeah, <laughs> it was a good few years ago. <laughs> Oh yeah, it's a completely different feel now. Oh, is it? Oh yeah, they um, they've now put uh, an inertia mechanics on it, so the tanks will leave the ground. They've put in light tanks, uh, of course, you know, medium and heavies. Yeah. Uh, SDGs. Um, they've put oh. in a large French line. You, of course, Russian and American and German. Yeah. Um, they have a British line. Also Chinese, J wow. Japanese, Polish, Czech, weed. Yeah, there wasn't that much, when I played it, there wasn't that much going for it in terms of um, like your choice of tanks. I think they probably had... Uh, two or three of the German tanks, probably like the Panzer and the and the Panzer and the like the smaller one, and then had a couple of the Brit and Americans. But and I think actually just when I was playing it, they just started putting in they they added a couple of French ones. Oh yeah, they got French lights, French mediums, French heavies. And French artillery now. Well, wow. I was just a fan of the. Um, they had a German uh, self-propelled gun, which I always liked. The grill. Yeah. Still in the game. Yeah, I always liked that one. Yeah, no, they, yeah, proper self. I can't remember how what the size of the barrel was, but you'd have to turn the whole damn tank to fire it. <laughs> yeah. Um, in fact, if you download, they'd probably give you a couple of free tanks after, you know. They probably would. But, uh, uh, they, like, last year, they actually, if you had a ongoing, a, a, an ongoing account, and you logged in, you got a, uh, what they called a, uh, oh, what was it? A Hellcat. Super Hellcat. Oh, really? Oh, really? Uh, yeah, um, to tier... Tier six or tier seven American TD tank destroyer. Nice. And it and it's turreted.
All right, guys. I am almost back. <laughs> there we go. All right, let me get back in this. But yeah, Phil, I got. I was able to do it that way, and it was like, hell yeah, I'll, uh, I'll make some payments. <laughs> yeah. Well, I just got a, um, I just got a check. I've got a, uh, I had an accident in August of last year on a public footpath, which I sued them for because it was, um, poorly maintained. Yeah. So the guy got about, uh, 4,000 pounds. So I um, bought some new equipment for the wife. Got a fridge and a washing machine and a new telly. And... <laughs> new equipment for the wife. <laughs> and uh... hey, what 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 website did you use for that? <laughs> <laughs> uh, and uh, yeah, and I uh, got some money left for a PC. So I bought myself a new computer. I don't blame you, dude. Yeah. The next new computer that comes in this house, Amber gets. <laughs> I said the next new computer that comes in this house, you get. Yeah, I know, but hell, remember when I bought this one? I tried to take talk in to let me order just order another one. <laughs> yeah, I offered to buy her one right after I did this one on payment slip, and now you can't do it again. I'm like, well, shit. <laughs> I was gonna buy her one. She's like, no, I don't ever have time to play it. And now she's sitting there, been sitting on her phone for two hours, watching videos, yeah. and she's like, you know, I do have time to play computer yeah. games if I want to. <laughs> I, do, I can't believe how many, I, I went to loads of different companies to have a look, because I wanted to, I didn't want to build my own. I, I can build my own, I've got the know-how, but I just didn't, I haven't got the time, and the kids would be under my feet all the time, and I don't know if I'd do it right, so, I just got a, a uh, custom one that you could customize. Yeah. So you start off with a basic case, or you can upgrade the case and motherboard, and you know all that stuff. Cho chose what I want in the inside the thing, and and just yeah, ordered it from there. But I went through about six different companies, deciding which one to get and how much I could spend and stuff. I ordered I ordered mine on Newegg as a kit. It wasn't a simple. It, it just came in, and all I had to do was. Yeah, put it together, plug put it up. Put it together, yeah. I, I looked at, um, uh, Blade Chaser put me into, like, put me, like, said, oh, well, have a look at PC Part Picker as well. And you get them from all over. You get them off Amazon and Newegg and stuff. You just order it. You can order it for just through, through PC Part Picker. But it was coming out at slightly more expensive than the build I was getting from the company, which is like, hmm. <laughs> so I just went with the with the company and they're building it for me now and it sh ships tomorrow I think awesome dude yes yeah, so I went all out so I, I, I future proofed myself a little bit so I went with a um, the Intel that I went for the i9 9900 processor and I went with a, a 20 2070 Super graphics card GTX 2070 Super Oh Jesus Christ JD Yes I still have I have nine diamonds on this freaking on, on this thing <laughs> When you switch ships the ones yes. you had in your hopper. Yeah, the ones that are in my hopper. Yeah. Uh, just how far? Or how, you're out of the bubble now, right? Yeah, I think. Pretty sure. Hell, just jettison the damn things. You know where to get no, more of them. I'm heading to a base now. Okay. Then sell them there. Whatever well, they heading... bring. Yeah, whatever they bring is still going to be positive. Yeah, whatever they bring, sell the stupid things. 
I'm heading to blue base. I got 11 more jumps to go. I think what I'm going to do is once I get to Colonia, or once I get up here to uh, Beagle Point, I think I'm going to head down to Colonia. So I'll be, if you're headed up towards Colonia to come up here and, you know, see what's there. Yeah. I'll be headed down, down towards you. System scan complete. All I can say is that if there's a base out there, let me know and I'll be happy. If I'm going to go out there and just see, uh, oh, there's an ab vegan. Gee golly. Well, if you go, if you head up there and go to the center of the universe, there is a base, one jump, like three light years from the supermassive black hole. What happens if you fly into the supermassive black hole? I don't know, I didn't try it. Well, they should have probes in this game. Right, gents, I'm gonna head off. I off feel appreciate you hanging in the out. UK. No worries. I'll see you guys later. Alright, All right, bud. We'll be on tomorrow. Later. Alright, man. Alright, later, bud. Take care. Later. Sounds like JD's now working on something. I'm, I'm trying to get somewhere because uh, I'm going to have to get off here um, when Tiffany texts me to get her. Well, just log out. You're in the like middle of playing. nowhere. Ain't nothing going to be... Take it in there and let him fill up my Dr. Pepper. Okay. What, the kids got fountains too? <laughs> no, he's got the fridge full of all the two liters. Here he comes, Amber. You got up. Look at him. Dink. There he goes. Seriously? What'd he do? Yeah, he's he's playing like he's got a store, so Hope he doesn't go up on prices. <laughs> Carrying cigarettes too? Don't, don't say don't say it too loud, he'll come here and get the carton. Why is some of these scans take forever? So I'm just gonna let the geological run and see how many is there. Thirty-nine. I do need to hit some of these, like on the way back, especially. <laughs> what 
Thank you, love. Looking for it, baby. What you gonna work on? Okay. You like them planes, don't you? And looks like it just jumped up behind my computer. And there goes Duke. There's a noise outside. Bark, bark, bark. Saved y'all. I don't know why y'all were so ungrateful. I've saved y'all from two, two male men, four squirrels. In a plastic bag. Yeah. Well, Smokey, it's, I saved you from a leaf that blew across the yard. So, now that they've changed the parameters, are you consider? Um, are you reconsidering or still considering getting a carrier? I have reconsidered. I think I will be getting one. That's the reason. Instead of circumnavigating, because you know when when everybody else kind of dropped out, weren't playing. You know, it's just kind of me and Gibbon popping on and bullshitting in the mornings. My plan was to get up here to Beagle Point, and then basically to hang a left and play NASCAR, just keep turning left all the way around the edge of the universe. You know? That would have took you forever. <laughs> well, like I say, my goal, and it still is a goal, is to see 100,000 different systems and scan them I'm at 3,700 and change so I got a ways to go you know I think I figured it up. It takes. What was it? I figured it up and I was 
figured, you know, on average, 10 minutes per system, you know, to scan and all that, you know, you're not going to scan it every damn system. Some are going to take longer, some are going to take like two minutes, you're going to be done. And I think I figured it out, if I started and did it continuously and didn't stop, it would take me something like two years, real life time, to do 100,000 systems. I know it was something crazy like that. Number 21. Yep. What you need, love? Okay, hang on. What, she need me? JD, take this right here to mommy. Tell her to, tell her to try that one. Uh huh. I don't know. Put it back. Put it back. Put it in the drawer or something. Is that something mean you need to talk about, Amber? Hey, Amber, before you get started, are we going to do lasagna tonight? <laughs> Guess what her response to that was? Did it... Was it a small little itty bitty finger going up in the middle? No, no, no. Because she's going to have to go to the store to get lasagna. And she went... Oh, I just took my bra off. You know what? We'll have it tomorrow night. How about that? You don't have to go out. I don't know. Cheese? Cheeseburgers. We'll throw it out. Sorry, but it is this time again. Damn. I might have to call this Dr. Jones again. You know? I gotta get some more of these. Hell, I'm gonna buy all these damn things. Well, hey, you still got some of these, right? The tramadol? 
Okay, I'll just borrow you one of yours. Alrighty, let's see what we got going on here. Hey, picked up another viewer. Welcome. While you're doing that, it could be could be cooking. I'm sorry. Big old big old pan of lasagna and some garlic bread tonight. Ooh, that sounds so good. And you know JD loves the garlic bread. It's Daniel. Oh, hang on a second, let me answer this. Yo, keep your language clean. You're on the internet. I told you, you're going to have to buy me dinner first and get me really, really drunk. But Prime will do it for free. Are you there? I think he hung up on me. <laughs> All right, y'all. <laughs> oh. Yes, y'all, that's what happens when you have a smart-ass friend. You call them with a... With a question or something. Oh, I doubt it. I'll call him. Let me get this system scanned and I'll call him back. Well, if, if a kid needs something, he'll get what he needs. Alrighty. <laughs> Y'all give me a second so I can call my buddy back and see what he needed. Y'all, I will be back in a moment. Hey, buddy, I don't know what happened. I guess you lost me. I think I did lose you. Uh, hang on a second. Hey, Viper, can you hear me? I can hear you. Okay, can you hear me on the screen? No. Okay, it's not broadcast. All right, so what's up, dude?
it in me a few minutes. Oh, so, does, she, does this girl know you are married? Okay, what is going on with you in Zero? She ain't bad looking. She ain't bad looking at all. I'm a, I tell you what, dude, I'm just do, I'm just do it this way, okay? Free advice, what it is, if she drops us a signal, and that's what you want to do, you do it, okay? But I'm telling you now, if you're planning on ditching sir, you just need to tell her straight up, we be done.
I mean, don't get me wrong, Sarah seems all right, but after, you know, that whole cheated on you to begin with, I mean, that ink wasn't even dry on the fucking bear certificate. I mean, honestly, with you, when y'all come up here that night with that here in the garage joking around, I wouldn't do it. Just the way we were joking around and shit. I swear, if hell, if I'd kept my joke, I could have probably talked to that girl out of the blow job that damn night. You know? I just had that feeling, you know, I'm not going to do that to you. I don't do that to my buds. But that's just the feeling I got. You know, when you told me that other time, well, I fucking escaped. System scan complete. Maybe, maybe your ass needs to go into the Air National Guard. That way you know how to bail the fuck out. Frameshift drive charging. crash out. She might still be looking for a way. She got any youngins or anything like that? Well, that's good. and everything, right? She ain't a dipshit. Well, how long have y'all two been talking now? Just a week? Just tell her, say, look, say, if you just want somebody to hang out with and have, you know, that sort of deal, that's fine. Looking for something else. Let's see where it goes. But you know, get out and do. You need to get away from the crazy bitches you with now. Because if you don't, I mean, you need to, if it ain't nothing to call her ass and just be like, look, no, we, we need to just see a thing. You know?
somewhere else, dude. System scan complete. You gonna put up that shit? You're gonna put up that shit. If you're not gonna put up that shit, well. French shift drive no. charging. Seem like fun. All right, there we go. I'm back. Awesome. Hop on your server real quick. All righty. Stop for a second. Viper, you still there, bud? Yeah, I'm here. I was about to get off. Unsupported mood, what the? Sounds like your buddy's in a dilemma. You're in a dilemma? No, it sounds like your buddy is in a dilemma. Oh yeah, it does, don't it? Yeah. Like I told him, get rid of crazy before you dip your toes in mother crazy. That girl he married is an idiot. But I'll be right back. JD wants me to do something, so Hank, give me just a second, okay? Be right back. Yellow. Okay. Are you ready for the surprise? Yes, I'm ready for the surprise. You have 24 hours to find where I live, or I'm hacking everything. You're hacking everything, huh? Okay, that's a bad racket. Yeah, okay, buddy. I'm going to jump back on here with my buddy on mine, okay? Uh, what? No, I heard you. That's not connected to my phone, no. Okay, I don't know, buddy. All right, I'm gonna get on. My, I'm gonna get on there with my buddy, okay? Hey, man, I'm back. Okay. Oof. All 
let's see what we got in here in this system. Yes, buddy. Let's see here, son. You want me to check and see if you make sure it didn't Bluetooth into mine? not my computer son mine is that one one nine two six I think that's yours take go in there and get next to your computer go I've got to get another computer to set up next to this one. What's that? Why do you need another computer? Just get you another monitor. Dude, I got two monitors, but when I... Did what? It's not connected to my computer, son. Okay, well, I don't know, son. No, because when I switch, sometimes it wants to freaking hang it up. As if they're in blank back and forth, and it's annoying as hell. I need to get like a small little... I need to get this stuff. Cheap ass something. That's it over here. When I need to look at other stuff, you know. Two hundred and eighty four more jumps. I'm all bad of damn pain medication soon. I've got to go get back to that damn get to another damn doctor. Forty-seven planets are bodies in this system. Jesus. Yeah. I think I'm 
I'll sit right here and take a moment. I'm actually going to turn on the air conditioner in here because Amber, for some reason, turned it off. I know why she turned it off because she's sitting on the side of the bed. Well, I'm going to go ahead and get off here, dude. All right, man. You go ahead. Ugh, Jesus Christ, don't ask me why I'm freaking slow. I know why I'm sleepy. You moved a 700-pound damn piano today. No, it was yesterday. Or oh, yesterday. Before. I'd be tired, too. Hey, baby. No, I didn't go to bed. We'll see. Uh, no, wait, that was... Saturday I did that. Sunday I cleaned up around a little bit and uh, and was playing it. But I went to bed late last um, late last night and woke up early this morning to get the trailer back. I got you. And it's been raining. Well, that'll do it. And tomorrow I'm gonna set up the dual monitors on my computer. I'm going to have a 32-inch TV with a 22-inch TV right next to me. That'll work. I wish mine didn't, like, freak out. Because when I go to click on the other monitor, you know, it closes my damn game. I wonder if I could just went and put my game in Windows mode. Or Window mode. If it would still do that. Shouldn't. You're right, it should. I'm going to get this system scanned out. Okay, let's see what I can figure out. Yeah, if you see Spike, tell him I'm on streaming. Okay. I ain't nice. seen him in a few days either. I tell you what, whoever logs into the stove is going to be pleasantly surprised. Yeah, well, all this I mean, shit filled up. I got, yeah. I got everything cooked off right now. Nice. AJ's gonna log into that and go, what the hell, I can't put anything in there. Tell him, yeah, JD, JD played Santa Claus. That's what I do, you know? I ate some of that lasagna yesterday, and then I ate some today. Dude, I've had the worst gas. <laughs> Yeah, but if I got that stuff, tastes good, don't it? Oh, it does. Yeah, it does, but... Be a whole lot better. I mean, and it's that, that really, really harsh gas. It's the one that, like, you know that it's coming out with such force that you don't know if you should trust it or not before you even try to push it out. Like, just let it go. Let it go. Let it go. It's been raining here most of the day. How about you? Uh, Amber, did it rain out there today? Amber said it rained. Yeah, it's still raining. Last time there. I peeked outside, it was really cloudy. But it hadn't rained yet. It's been raining. It, it rained about four times a day. Yes. No. Okay, no, it didn't rain here today. It didn't rain yesterday. Huh. Raining like crazy here. That's what it did here yesterday. It take a whole day for it to get here from... Usually it takes two or three hours. Yeah. 
for 45 minutes if there's tornadoes involved. Yep, tornadoes involved, yeah, it kind of pushes it on. No, but uh, like I say, it was cloudy as I'll get out here today, but we never did get any rain. I say, I don't know, dude, I haven't. Other than when I went outside earlier, I haven't been outside today. I know yesterday when it did rain, my damn back and hip was just killing me. I think it's the settling into my damn left hip. And it's very unpleasant. Everything's twisted around, so. What? What is it? Come on, turn, damn it. Oh, never mind. It's not like a scene on the wall. Yeah, I'm trying to figure out what the hell you're freaking out about. I get the system scanned, I'm going to cut out of the stream for a minute. Okay. And, uh... Yeah, I'm going to set, turn this off. Alright, bud. I'll talk to you. Alright, man. I'll talk to you. Hell, if you get, when you get done with tanks, if you get bored, pop back over here. Alright. Hell, one thing about it, you ain't had no problem with the audio today. Cool. Whatever it is, I think you fixed it. Alright, dude. I'll see you in a bit. Alright, man. Take it easy. Sorry, I had to turn on that AC. System. Let's see what we got going on there. Yeah, because I've been broadcasting like three and a half hours. It's time to go take a 30 minute break or so. Alright, y'all. Appreciate you. I'm going to bell off here and see if I can fix a couple of problems I'm having uh, stream-wise. Maybe. And the problem I'm having with the game is well. Because when I want to go over here to do stuff over here, it shuts down the screen over here and I'm not liking that. But yeah, y'all. 
I do appreciate you. I will catch y'all in here uh, probably an hour or two. Later.